Okay, we are at Point Lobos, and we are at Whaler's Cove. And I don't know if we'll be able to see out there, but there is whales out there. So, we just saw them a few minutes ago. It is pretty crazy. But Well, Lobos did some other areas we're going to check out here, but this is Whaler's Cove, the first one. That's the first spot you really pretty much come in and turn to the right and you're down there. These are narrow roads and a lot of, it's very popular, there's just a lot of people here. Uh, just trying to see if we can catch uh, Bird, all you see is the bird diving in right now. But when we first pulled up, there was some whales coming up, or at least a whale. I can't tell. Okay, so we climbed up the stairs, we were right down there. So, climbed up some stairs, get up on this hill. Now uh, we're overlooking that same little Whaler's Cove. Okay, we're still up on top of that little hill. Now we found up some steps. I'll show you those steps later because we're going to go back down them. But this is uh, pretty cool. These are the steps we were just went up and when we came back down because we're gonna drive to a different area of the park. But we go up and just around that little curve right there is the top. So and then we just come back down and we are back to a little parking area. And now we will drive to a different part of the park. Okay, so we're at the Weston Beach. Weston, I think it's called Beach area. It's not really much of a beach, it's just but I guess you can they call it a beach because you can walk down by the water. But it's definitely not an area I would go swimming in but or go in the water in but Alright, so we walk down a little bit out here towards the water a little bit more. Yet.
Okay, here we are. We just walked out a little bit further out on these rocks. But that's it. There's the beach that we walked on to. And now we are out here. So. Okay, so as you can see, I walked out a little bit further. I'm up a little bit higher on these rocks. Crazy. Trying to walk without really losing my balance here. You can see this is not like walking even ground or anything. Alright, so we are over at the Bird Island Trail area. I'm guessing if we decide that we want to go walk a little bit again we got some steps so but this is pretty much the end of the park right here and then you got some trails beyond that other than that there was a couple spots that we've tried to get into but parking is limited at this park for some really reason until you get down at towards the end of the park but it seems like they have trails that go throughout the park so if you want to park on one end and just walk it would be one heck of a walk but you could do that too Okay, so we're at the top, we climbed up some steps, and this is the trail we're on. You can see down in there, nice blue cove of water there. It is beautiful. But been walking around the park for a while, we've been down on the beach, everything. This is the only place that you can get a little fishy smell. We're definitely, definitely, this is, this is awesome. You can't beat this scenery, I tell you. And this uh, Point Lobos, Lobos, Point Lobos, is uh, up by Carmel, was it Monterey, that area, so off the one. Okay, if you see down there, those those little specks down there are seals. I didn't really pay attention to it. We saw the sign, but we weren't really... Are they seals? Oh, they are mom and pops need the rest. Let's see. Seals, yep. So, that is pretty cool. So, this is the, another view of that cove. The nice blue, clear water. Okay, so that far little island there, that's what they call Bird Island. On this end, you can't see a lot of birds. I mean, down by the water, there is some on the edges. And then there's a bunch over here on these little, the small strip of island that goes around here. But we're down by the ocean, and we're 
You can smell it. It's fishy. It's the only part in the park that seemed to be fishy was this uh, trail. What?